works, too? So mysterious. What do you think Patter and Flap are up to? Only one way to find out. Wait! Why are we waiting? Is something wrong? No. Waiting a little bit just makes it more suspenseful. <laughs> <laughs> Prepare, dear Enchantimals, for something quite good. A grand adventure through Wonderwood. You'll have to solve clues along the way to celebrate this special day. Oh, how fun! But try to move quickly. Don't dawdle, dear friends. You must finish our puzzles before the day ends. Your journey begins finding something that grows. It's really quite simple. Just follow your nose. Well, what do you suppose that means? Hmm, ours is blank. Blank? Huh, maybe Patter and Flap made a mistake. Or maybe it's the first clue. Hmm, follow your nose. Hmm. Yeah! <laughs> Not sure that's what they want us to do, Sprint. Wait, do you guys smell something? <laughs> hey, not me. Gary. Yearwood blossom. Huh? This paper smells like a yearwood blossom. I'd recognize its beautiful fragrance anywhere. Right, Caper? Oh, yeah, that yearwood blossom. Uh, they want us to find a yearwood blossom? But those are nearly impossible to find. I've never seen a yearwood before. They only blossom for a few short moments, one time a year. Usually around this time, actually. Patter showed us the blossom so we could use its pollen to make medicines at the clinic. Sprint and I know where we can uh -huh. find them. Hold well, on, what are we waiting for, animals? Let's move, move, move! <laughs> I don't know where we're going. Danessa, lead the way. <laughs> Let's move, move, move! <laughs> uh, 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 this is so awesome! I've been saying we should go on a big epic adventure. Haven't I been saying that, Caper? Yep, she has. The clues said something about today being a special day. Any idea what makes today so important? Well, it's not time for the Wonderwood Festival. That was last month. Hmm, is today a holiday? Uh, I think you eat all the berries you want day. Twist, there isn't a holiday called eat all the berries you want day. <laughs> well, get yumpy. <gasps> the yearwood blossom. Wait, better make sure. Yep, that's the one. Huh? What's it doing? I think it's opening. This only happens once a year. It's so special that we're here to see it. Oh, oh, another clue. How clever. Oh, what's it say? For your next clue, you will have to spy some trees that tower in the sky. But don't take long. It's now or never. We know you'll find them. You are very clever. Very clever? Hmm, that's definitely another clue. Oh, well, there's a place in the woods where Twist and I pick berries no. for recipes. It's surrounded by some of the tallest trees in Wonderwood. That's gotta be it. Bree, Twist, lead the way. Uh, this is the place. Everybody, spread out and see if you can find the next clue. Huh? Find anything yet, Twist? Twist! Oh, oh. Ah, there's no such thing as eat all the berries you want day. Dug it! Great job, Flick! Flick is still the best finder in Wonderwood. Oh, thanks. Onward and upward to find the next clue, the tallest tree offers a bird's eye view. Hmm. The clue must be at the top of one of these trees. The ugly is the tallest. <gasps> I got an idea. Now meet us halfway between Jungle and Wonder by the end of the day. <laughs> <laughs>
between Jungle and Wonder. Do they mean Junglewood and Wonderwood? Let's see. Junglewood is here. Wonderwood is over here. So halfway between them would be right here. Great. So that's where we'll find Patter and Flap. I don't think there's any way to make it there before sunset. Uh, get more. If you want to move fast, let us give you a hand. The best way to travel isn't always by land. Of course! We'll just fly to Power and Flap. Let's go! <laughs> None of us can fly, Sage. <sighs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> True. But I think I know what they're hinting at. The babbling brook! Okay, who's ready for a swim? Uh, when we agreed to this adventure, I don't remember any kind of heads up that we'd have to get wet. Huh? What about that? Hmm, that could work. <laughs> oh! Left! The water! Right! Check it out! I didn't even get wet! Oh, oh. Ugh, I guess I spoke too soon. And look, the sun hasn't set. We made it in time! I remember this place. This is where we first met Patter and Flap. <laughs> Wonderful job, you guys. I just knew you'd be able to figure out our clues. So, did y'all have fun today? Oh, so much fun! Right? I'm actually kind of sad it's over. Well, then, you're in luck because Flap and I have one more puzzle for you to solve. What is so special about today? <laughs> it's not Berry Day, Twist. Ugh. Let's see. Oh, we found a flower that only blossoms once a year. Like an anniversary. There was that clue about Junglewood, which is where Flap and Patter used to live. And we rode those logs down the babbling brook. Just like Patter and Flap did. When, when they, they first came, came to Wonderwood. Wonderwood. Today's the one-year anniversary of you two coming to Wonderwood and becoming our friends! Yeah! That's right! Every day we've spent with you has been a great adventure. So Flap and I wanted to give you a fun adventure in return. <laughs> and the sun hasn't set yet, which means you're just in time. In time for what? <laughs> for the anniversary party, of course. <laughs> At a party too? Pattern flat friendship anniversary day just keeps getting better and better. Best ever. Love you guys. We love you too. Go for a twist. After all, it is a very special day. <laughs> <laughs> Wild, but this is the first time we've run into a dried out pond. I don't understand it. There's always lots of water here. When do we do now? I guess this means our show is cancelled. Oh no! We can't perform our water extravaganza in a little puddle. It wouldn't be very, well, extravagant. What do we do, Validity? Well, whenever there's a problem, we ask the babbling brook for help. We do the same thing in the Grazy Grasslands. Her waters show us the most divine images. Come on, get that. Here it is, our beautiful babbling brook. Babbling? More like trickling. What happened to all the water? <laughs> Excuse me. Watch where you're going, silly beaver. <laughs> Rude. Babbling Brook, where is your water and the water in Wonderwood Pond? Uh, maybe we
we should call back later. I don't get it. I think the babbling brook might be broken. It can't be! <gasps> what would Everwild be without the babbling brook? Not now. I'm sure there's something we can all do to help, but I'm just not sure what that is yet. We have to think of something. One way or the other, we'll get to the bottom of this mystery. Mystery? <laughs> I love a good mystery. Hey, whoa! What's going on with the babbling brook? Well, it seems to be drying up. Wonderwood Pond, too. Yikes! That's not good. But, but the babbling brook is the source of all the water in Everwild. Exactly! We need to find out what's going on. Hmm. I bet I can figure this out. So, we have a lot of water that's gone missing. Yikes. Right. And what needs a lot of water? Um, our extravaganza! Yep! Here it goes! Uh-huh! Nope! A whale! Yep! A what? Yep! A whale! A huge whale! Yeah, a dirty whale! And she's so thirsty, she flies all over Everwild, drinking up all the water! Yep, I'm pretty sure that's what happened. Yeah! Totally! This is terrible! A giant thirsty whale ruined our show! Oh, no! That do it! Um, a whale? Yep, a giant flying whale. <sighs> well, I've never heard of giant flying whales, but thanks for the fun story. No props. <laughs> flying whales. They would be a great addition to our show. No water in Wonderwood Pond. That's awful. Okay, any theories? Hmm. Somehow the water has been let out. Maybe there's a plug. Yes. Somebody probably pulled that plug. Oh. You just need to plug it back up. Of course. Are you sure do have some interesting ideas here in Wonderwood? <laughs> Bree, you're the best fixer in town. Can you help us figure it out? Hmm. I don't know where the water is, but I think I know how you can get it back. You put the thingy on the doohick and attach it to the Bang Diddy Clang Clang. Huh? Hmm. You've got the vaporizer -izer. And problem solved! Ooh. Great! Let's do it! We'll be performing in no time. Hmm. Except I'm not sure how to put a doohickey into the frizzolator without a whippity whip. And I'm all out of whippity whips. Oh, what are the odds? Well, uh, if we happen to find a whippity whip, we'll be sure to let you know. Okay, bye. Oh. You're our last hope, Danessa. Can oh. you help us solve this mystery? Yes. Any thoughts on where the water is gone? Hmm. Well, I once read this old story about this really ginormous hippopotamus who loves bubble baths. <laughs> but she's so big, all the water spills out of the tub. So she travels from town to town, taking baths wherever she finds water. And once she jumps in, the water splashes out because, well, ginormous. Hmm, I think Sprint told me that story. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Makes sense. Makes sense to me, too. Me, please. That'll did it. Okay. <laughs> we'll keep an eye out for a wet hippo. Thanks, Danessa. Well, the pond still looks the same. Will we ever solve this oh-so-mysterious mystery? <laughs> that cranky beaver just interrupted my dramatic moment. Those other beavers we saw were very rude, too. Very rude indeed. Too fast. Rude. Oh, that's weird, because the beavers around here are usually pretty friendly. Oh, I do. Oh. Oh. Hey. Oh. Oh. My instincts are telling me we should follow them and see what's up. Yeah, that does. Hmm. This is interesting. That dam wasn't here the other day. Ah, that must be new. Oh, no! Wait. What does that have to do with the babbling brook? This new dam is completely blocking the water from flowing down the babbling brook and into Wonderwood Pond. Ah, that solves the water mystery. But why are the beavers so cranky? Yeah! Rude! 
Well, they don't have any place to swim on this side of the dam. They like to be surrounded by water. Just like we do! <laughs> Silly beebles. We're gonna have to figure out how to move this dam so the water can flow again. Oh, but that will make those crabby beavers even crabbier. Too crabby. Rude! Well, we all want the same thing. To be surrounded by water again. Oh! I feel like... Great idea, Flick. Be right back. In the water, and then just move it under the dam. Oh. Oh, no. Looks like they like the idea. Who's ready for a water extravaganza? <laughs> well, that's more like it. Yay! That's a way with the show. It's going to be even more awesome now, thanks to your great idea. <laughs> now, there's only one way to check if the babbling brook is back to normal. Babbling brook, are things all right in Wonderwood again? <laughs> yep, everything looks just right. Yay! <laughs> Come on, we don't want to be late. And now, I would like to present the one, the only, Fancy Flamingo and her best besties, <laughs> along with some very special oh. guests. Some feel better ice cream. <laughs> How are you feeling, Sprint? <laughs> Sprint, Twist and I heard you weren't feeling well, so we brought you some flowers. Oh, that is so sweet of you, too. It looks like sniffle season is starting early this year. I know. And Sprint and I had a best evening all planned. Huh? Oh. <laughs> uh, anything we can do to help out, Danessa? Well, I am running low on feel better ice cream. Mm -hmm. Think you could pop over to the ice cream truck and pick some up from the penguins? Mm. Uh, oh, of course. Twist and I wouldn't mind. Uh, would we, Twist? <laughs> Well, I know just what to do. <laughs> you two need some rest and plenty of feel better ice cream. Yeah. There you go. You two take it easy. I'll be back in a flash. <laughs> Sounds good as new. Uh -huh. Hey, Prina, Jayla. Danessa sent me for more feel better ice cream. Sprint and Twist both have the sniffles, so make it extra feel better if you can. You got it. Hey, 
Wait, what's with the tiny bell? Oh, that? That's just to attract customers. Does it work? Well, you're here. Oh, true, but I'm the only one. Your ice cream is so good, there should be a line all the way to the babbling brook. Tell you what. You whip me up a scoop of carrot ice cream for the road, and after I drop this off the animal clinic, I'll come back here to give your sound system some oomph! Oh, that sounds like a big job. And they all lived happily ever after. The end. <laughs> oh, oh my. We haven't read these in a long time. Oh, they're so dusty. <sighs> you know, I haven't heard either of you sneeze for a while. I think all of this bed rest is making you better. Oh no, still sneezy. Well then, how about some more pillows? And more ice cream. <laughs> Oh no, Caper, you too. Uh, uh. You need snuggles and ice cream, stat. <laughs> <laughs> your truck with all kinds of noise-making whatchamajigs and tune them to make the perfect ice cream sound. Jayla, give it a ring. Okay. Ugh. Oh, that was weird. Try it again. <gasps> what is that sound? I don't know, but it doesn't really make me want to eat ice cream. <laughs> Which means we're getting close. She's been working so hard. Um, who needs ice cream? Danessa, you need a break. Why don't you let me keep an eye on our besties for a while? <sighs> Sage, you're so sweet. But I'm not gonna leave the besties until they're all cured. <laughs> they, uh, look pretty cured to me. Huh? They're not resting in there? <laughs> 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 Sniffles! Well, I'm marching right in there and telling them the party's over. Hang on. I have another idea. Uh, Madam, wake up, wake up, wake up! I was reading through my medical books and realized that you guys do not have the sniffles. You have the super sniffles! You get the buffet! Lucky for you, I read all about how to cure super sniffles. We need to get your hearts pumping. First up, let's all head outside for 90 minutes of early morning jumping jacks. Huh? Okay, doctor's orders. Let's jump, jump, jump! <laughs> Okay, great job, you guys. Oh, I bet you're tired. <laughs> well, let's all head inside for a rest. <sighs> hey, guys. So, Danessa asked me to take away your mattresses. <gasps> the firm support is supposed to be great for super sniffles. <laughs> them 
to re-roof the clinic? Mm-hmm. I told them that the high altitude would be good for them. those last sniffle cures weren't exactly the most fun. <laughs> but this next cure is something we know you'll love. Who wants ice cream? <laughs> what is this? It's veggie mush ice cream. A special blend of boiled celery and creamed corn. <laughs> It'll cure your sniffles in no time. No, no, please, we're fine. We're not sick. Uh, I'm not at all. Wait, you're not really sick? No! <gasps> you made it all up? Yes. Yeah, yeah we know. We know. No, we are. Apology accepted. Uh, 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 oh, no, Danessa, you got the sniffles. Well, what are you waiting for? Get down to the penguin truck and bring her some feel better ice cream. <laughs> okay, I think we finally got it. Give it a try, Jayla. Oh. That's the original bell ring. No, it's not. Listen. Yeah, that's totally the original bell ring. I I'm sorry, guys. I feel like I let you down. Yeah, I, 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 I